he um, because you didn't tell him well you have to have to be totally focused or else you're gone but he came to you and said well I'm quitting well I, I demand that everyone's totally focused and that they step up to the plate and everything but with Peter you know it's been in the band for such a long time yeah. I can't I don't feel like I can tell him what to do you know and um, with me I was so kind of absorbed with the whole thing with the band writing music maybe I'm stepping on toes taking over you know um, but that's just the way I work you know and but I did he tell you things about this maybe that stepping toes <coughs> and well he did he did send me he gave me, gave me a tape of riffs around when we did uh, Deliverance I think it was and I was like listen to it I was like couldn't really find anything that I really liked but I was really trying to like th that riff is not too bad maybe we should do something with that riff and I played it to Lopez and Mendes and they was like no it's not good you're fooling yourself because you want to please him or something and I ended up not mentioning it to Peter I didn't say anything that I didn't like it and he didn't ask so it just kind of mm. and we didn't talk about that until after he left I asked him were you angry or disappointed by the fact that you wanted to contribute and nothing ended up in a song and he's like no I'm not angry but I always wondered because you never said anything and I was like yeah I'm sorry you know I did you know didn't know and I explained to him like I didn't want this to be a band where you're doing favors because you want to be nice to someone and bring in a riff that you don't really like yourself. And he never said anything to me about my songs that I didn't like anything. Uh, but s since then, obviously, he never came with ideas after that. And he's a little bit of a leader type of guy himself. And he wants to be creative, but he was never really creative with the band for the last 10 years with the exception of that tape with those riffs on. Maybe one, two minutes of riffs. Um, and I guess he must have felt that they don't need me. What the hell am I doing here? He was always a strong, like a, the fans loved him. And we always got along. There was never fights or anything. But um, he didn't get an outlet for his, his own creativity, I think. And maybe when Not that I wouldn't let him, but I feel I've earned the right to decide what is good enough for, for the band, musically. And what did he say about this, that he agreed? That it was more or less your crea creativity that spurred the band? Or? Yeah. Yeah, he agrees. It's, I said, I saw an interview with him lately. I don't know if it's done I can, after he left. or. But it said that Michael is uh, such a good, great songwriter and so much better than me, so I don't really need to... That kind of stuff. And... Uh, I'm not saying that's the case, but I've always been writing the songs, yeah. always. And even when me and him wrote together for the first two albums, it was more a case of me and him sitting like you and I are sitting now, playing guitar, and I was like, can you play this riff? And he's playing something, and I'm playing something on top of it. Uh, he rarely came up with ideas. He did come up with his own ideas, stuff that he'd written back home. But he was relying on writing together with me in order to have some results. But were you maybe then more the, 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 the strong figure maybe he needed in his songwriting, <coughs> maybe too strong, that he really, finally he brought his tape 
I don't know. And then he thought, well, it's true, I'm not that good. I don't know. Maybe that damped his creativity. I feel horrible now when I think about it, but it's, it wasn't, you know, it wasn't good enough, if you know yeah. what I mean. It was like for, it sounded like what I thought at the time, like rehashed and not as good ideas from three albums, four albums back, you know. He wasn't bringing anything new to the table and he wasn't bringing anything old to the table that was good enough to, to be used. And it didn't have a clear sense of direction, like if I get something, like I s slaughter a lot of my own ideas, which I have to understand. I'm not just bringing in all my own ideas and like, because I want to be the songwriter, you know. I write shitloads of stuff and a lot of good stuff I end up not using, a lot of it. So if I'm bringing, if I'm using something that, said, that, that, that Peter would have written, uh, that I don't really, really like, you know, I can't be doing favors, no. like, like be nice to, to, you know, like that, if you know what I mean. And also, because as I said, I, I was trying to fool myself into you, using something that he written just so that he, that he would feel part of it, even though I knew inside I didn't like it that much. And on top of things, Mendes and Lopez said, that's not good, that's shit. That's good from them then? Yeah, they don't fucking pretend. Yeah. 